Let's see. Tino is number 13. No, he's number 12. 12. Yeah. That's right. God, guys, don't start. Starting off in <laughs> battle. <laughs> <laughs> see if he learned from the uh, other set. Ooh, nice little follow-up. Can't quite finish. Not opting for the wobbles so far. Tino came from losers. Clean, easy uh, lead for Dr. Light right now. There we go. Nice. Oh. Not quite killing the Nana yet. Finally gets her down. I need to come up with some sort of like, like one of those like things that counts like boxing rounds, but like instead it'll just like tell the players like to wait like 20 seconds for me to load up a certain like graphic and then another 30 seconds for hand warmers and then it'll like flash a green light and they're ready to go. <laughs> yeah. Something like that so that I don't actually have a to tell them all this stuff. A little more production value. Yep. And that gives me time to do things like replays, Ooh. animated transitions. Mm -hmm. Nice little crouch cancel on that up smash and he converts off of it. Kills Nana there. It's gonna get him right back into this game. Evens it up. 2v2. Ooh, that air dodge was a little dangerous. <laughs> Drills the front of his shield. Surprised he didn't get wobbled for that. Ooh, that's a rough feeling. Just making a mistake at ledge and then losing 50% of your character. Let's see what his Sopo can do here, though. Tries to skull hammer back, gets it. But up throw, up air, bane of all low tiers. Tino's gonna try and play a little more conservatively this lead, just because he knows how dangerous these situations are right here. Gets wobbled. I feel like Tino kind of gives up the wobble too much. Yeah. Like, even, even if it's, it seems like it's guaranteed, yeah. they can always drop it. I've, mm -hmm. I've had Dr. Light drop wobbles against me. Yeah. It happens. Like, there's always a chance. <laughs> Skull hammer is bad. Some decent play here. He's not throwing the Nana Bolt though. Nice little combo there, but can't quite finish it. Let's see if he can take out this Nana right now. That's a very good chance. But as I say that, focuses on a Poco there. All right, Tina takes game number one. I don't know, it's... it's D. Drill shines him. Nice projectile play, trying to wall him out. I was smart of Tino to back off after that. Ooh. Oh, drops it. Oh, gets the jab. jab. Set, he gets set. the wobble. Tip, tap, 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 tap. tap he knows, tap. like, blinking along the taps, like, as he's watching his stock, like, <laughs> Who disappear is? before his eyes. Tino. Tino. <laughs> it's like, right when he got grabbed and, like, it started, like, wobbling, his eyes just started, like, blinking to the beat of the stocks, <laughs> and he's just, like, yeah. just watching his, his life flash before his yeah. eyes. <laughs> he went for some gnarly stuff there. That would have been so sick if like she jumped a little higher and yeah. like after she threw it and like Popo threw him, like the, the block hit him and then he can go in for like another regrab. Yeah. Maybe that's what he wanted to do. Oh can he he can't finish Nana. That's been his number one problem just with this matchup. He's gotta like focus on her, like treat her like an entirely different oh. person. He like got stabbed in the back by his girl, Nana Ledgehog. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> That's the worst. Yeah. 
I was just like, you gotta know, like, if she's grabbing the ledge, she might do a super slow get up, and you have to squall. Even though it's, like, not the best, like, at least you have a bit of a chance to live. Yeah. I can't tell if, um, like, sometimes they'll do something where, like, Jez Nana taunts. Is that, like, controlled by them? Or is that, no. like, just, like, an accident? Like okay, so sometimes after respawning, Nana will want to taunt as soon as she can when you land. Um, which is why you'll see players squall hammer from the uh, respawn platform so that she doesn't do that. Oh. And then most of the time it's just random, like... Earlier um, in their first set, uh, they were like near the edge, and she decided to taunt. Yeah. Which typically I've never seen before, but like usually it's only after respawn that she'll taunt. It would have been hilarious if he yeah. commanded that. <laughs> but you can't command taunts, and it's actually pretty funny if you get them alternating the taunt because yeah. they're swinging their hammers. And there's like, there's Icy's players that'll have Nana taunt while they chain grab Sheik. And it's just deliciously just so BM. Like it, it's a, like almost worthwhile to learn how to do that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to, cause wobbling is quite a, or I mean just Icy combos in general, they're quite the infuriating move. Yeah. Well, Tino up 2-1. Taking the hard. I thought it was the uh, two o, or two o. Oh, yeah. yeah. Taking the hard win on FD. Oof. That's very quick stop for Tino there. Yeah. Your ledge game has to be so tight against Fox. Otherwise, you just risk losing. Like uh, Doctor Light just did most of his character, but. Gets the down throw, re-grab combo. Down throw, down air, re-grab? Yeah, I think so. Mm. I th like, Popo down throw, down air, down air, Popo re yeah. Yeah. Couldn't quite finish that straight hit on the knock. Mm. Nana had much higher percentage than Popo right now. Yeah. Like, almost twice uh, as much. Yeah. Maybe like 20, 30 percent higher. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ooh, nice little read on that side B. <laughs> hmm. Tino playing this pretty safe. Yeah. Looks like he's. See, I. Th that might have been a miss input by him. Ooh, well, that was. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, well. Just like accidentally hitting the taunt button. Cleans out that wobble. I'm not too pleased with that one. Back even. <laughs> Grabs him. The yeah, big key is like punishing the fox when they oh. overextend. Dash attack grab? Yes. Dash attack grab is avoidable with you DI. Have to you have to what DI. What direction do you DI the dash attack? Um, the, uh, you DI away. It? Or like whichever direction they came from, you have to go away. Okay. They can't because it hits upwards. Yeah, it thing. launches you up. They can't run fast enough to grab that, or um, if you DI all the way away. Okay. Enough. Ooh. Oh wow! And offs. Wow. Ooh. Tino not happy. But here's that early kill. Good on Dr. Light for not getting discouraged. That's so rough to lose one of uh, first 10 seconds. Oh! Mash is out, though. Yeah, you gotta. <laughs> like, on reaction, you Ooh. gotta, like, blitz your hand over the top <laughs> of your controller. Yeah. <laughs> Dash dance and, like, spam triggers. The thing is, if you play too safe, you risk letting the Ice Climbers establish their movement game on you yes. if you're backing off too much. And that sort of happened with those wave dash down smashes earlier. The way I've seen like good players <laughs> do it is just like 
completely separate them and then like zero death Nana first. Yeah. It catches that poorly uh, sweet spot of recovery. I think Tino might be losing sight of like his his original game plan. Yeah. From these wobbles. He was playing really well game one and game two. Yeah. Um, just like not taking too many unsafe engagements, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I suppose she taunts after kills sometimes as well. Okay. Gonna save her? No. Oh, no save. Nice DI on that up there. All the way up and right, making it pretty difficult. Oh, oh tried to far. land. Tried to land on Randall. I can't imagine. It's so hard. The ice climbers have very good horizontal air drift. No, they really don't. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's Hogs his own girl. Interesting. So, hitting both characters with a horizontal downward directional move near the edge is really good because then it like launches them towards the yeah, edge. One of them will grab shield, it and the other yeah. one will get screwed. Yeah. One will get pushed further too. Mm -hmm. And then from there you can do your ledge refresh. And maybe get something if they try and take that platform. So just in general, like finding a way to force both of them to have to grab edge. Yeah, it's generally pretty good. Yeah. Because if okay. the if the popo if you have to burn your double jump to get to edge, Nana's pretty much not grabbing ledge. Yeah. Because you have to fall off immediately and up E or squall to save her. Right. Or you have to completely give her up. So getting in that space that forces that is really good. Oh, jeez, yeah, and that's like... Nice up tilt. Power shield back throw. Oh, I hate that so much. Missing ledge dashes, or wave lands. On oh, a, on this stage especially. <laughs> on those platforms, and you if you're spacey, like you can't grab the edge. Also, uh, wave landing on this stage is tough near the edge. Yeah, because it, it just it's hangs just over. Different angle, yeah. yeah. The the standard like low, like slightly under the horizontal will like yeah. cause you to just you're not sure that. Oh, that was cool. It's that get up. Oh, no, we got game five, grand finals. Tino on his potential last stock, or uh, rather. Last set of the game, last yes. match of this particular set. Yes. <laughs> There's a chance that Tino might lose his turn. His tournament might end here. Yes. Jesus, how many different <laughs> ways do I have to say that? Oh, can't get anything out to the outside. That was <laughs> cool. Down yeah. throw forward air. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if it's timed correctly, you can get the meteor hit and then jab reset. Yeah. And then re grab. Yeah. <laughs> repeat. Ooh, reverse bear. Bear, really good move in this matchup because it auto cancels, it's quick. Um, and it can sort of contest with Fox's speed a bit. Do you know the, the frames in the beginning of the end that it auto cancels? Um, I th think it's like the. Uh, I'm not exactly sure, but I know like the general feel for it is just an immediately, it's immediately back air yeah. after you short hop, so that you you land towards yeah. the end of the animation. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, you just get a quick smash out of that too. Yeah. <laughs> That's how I land my nair rests. Mm -hmm. Just immediate nair, immediate short hop nair, mm -hmm. rest as soon as you land. Ooh, up tilts. You don't want to be here, Dr. Lad. <laughs> don't go down there. Oh, jeez. Tino with the sizable lead. Gonna decide. Ooh. Nice little desync action. Oh, he doesn't use the most advanced desyncs, but he uses. He uses them in the right situations. Well, Tino's finally able to space these drills a bit better and not get grabbed for him, which is pulling him out big time. Uh, 
Uh, it's so rough yeah. being above a fox. The yeah. best you can do is down air, but that's like a nice. worse hit. That's like a Roy Fair, <laughs> any Roy Aerial. It just does nothing. Impeccable DI from Dr. Light there. Not getting, oh, not getting up aired, but eventually gets boxed up out of air. Yeah, gets the kicks. Big drill, no SDI really. I think a big key too is some of his SDI ability on this drill is not where it was the other sets. Ooh. That was, that was a nice one. Mm -hmm. See it not a <laughs> taunt. This is like definitely not helpful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice air dodge. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> not a oh, oh, wow. She almost. I think he could have made it back. Yeah. I think he held back a bit trying to. Avoid. Yeah, he did, just never got the. I think he assumed he grabbed the ledge and then.